Ugh. Wh wh where am I? What the? Begin test. What the? Okay, I can't go back. Can't go up. That's the void. And I have speed particles. Okay, let me just... Okay, well, I mean, that's the door over there, and... Oh! Wait, that's a platform, just like the one I'm on. But, like, how do I get to it? Wait, wh what's this? Gravity shifter? I wonder. <gasps> now I can get out! Alright guys, sorry for that bad acting, no, but I was just demonstrating something that I've been working on, and that's potions that can invert and revert gravity. And so it's actually based on a pretty basic concept, let me just show you, right here. All this is, is this is a timer, and it's going, and it's searching for this effect, which is regeneration. So this is actually a renamed regeneration potion. And when it finds that effect, it's going to take it away from me, which is then going to send out an output to here to TP me negative 7 in, I think that's X, yeah, X, and then 4 up. So I was actually in here, in this little box right here. And then what I did was, see, I was down there. And then it made me go 7 over, which is right there. And then this is actually just this exact same box. I just flipped it with MC Edit. And then it just go, makes me go up 4, and then over that way, 7. Which puts me down into there. And then this is just a little room that I spawned in. You know, basic. And then these are just some simple command blocks. This one... What does this one do? This one clears my inventory, and then this one sets the command block output to false, just because I like it like that. And then this one, I think, does keep inventory. Yep, keep inventory. This one TPs me inside the box. TP, TPs me inside there. This one gives me the renamed potion. And then this one gives me unlimited speed. Let me just put all that back. And then this line right here isn't necessary at all. All you really need is that line. Because this line is for something that I've actually been working on separately outside of here. This one searches for strength. And then when it finds the strength, it TPs me over again. So, it te so the regeneration splash potion TPs me that way into that box and then what would happen is that one would then tp me this way and that yeah i know that the command the uh, tp coordinates weren't exactly the same that's just because i haven't really messed around with that second line too much and then so it'll tp me back into here looking like i went up on top and then i came back down and i'm actually trying to make gravity guy if any of y'all have ever played that game it's on iPhone. I'm pretty sure it's on Android. I don't know. I haven't played on Android. But, um, yeah. And then this one just gives me a regeneration potion again. And then this one gives me a strength potion. Because I was originally going to have it. So this one, which is the strength line, gave me a... Oh, no, no. This one was the regeneration line. The regeneration line gave you another regeneration potion. And then the strength line, this one... Gave you another strength potion, but then you had two potions, and you there was a chance that you could accidentally mess up and TP yourself outside of the boxes, which would break the game. So I actually came up with the idea last night to switch them. That way, whenever I had strength, it would give me a regen potion, and whenever I had regen on, it would give me a strength potion. That way, you would only have one potion, so there was no chance of breaking the game. See, let me just reset that. See, and then here's the regen potion. Just splash that. TP's me, see, and then I get strength. And then 
TPs me back, and I get another regen. See, but I'm in creative mode, so it didn't take these two away. But, uh, yeah, guys, that's just a little concept I, ca little concept I came up with. I might not be the first one to come up with it, but, I mean, hey, it's pretty cool. I mean, I searched around YouTube because I kind of wanted to play the Gravity Guy game, and I searched around on YouTube and actually couldn't find any Gravity Guy maps or anything. So, I mean, I was like, hey, you know what, I'll just make one. So, that map will be do done probably really soon with the help of my friend MVP Assassin, aka the Nickaholic11, and Dr. World 9570 also known as Craftable Blocks. They help me with a lot of my builds, and they're helping us with the adventure map. So... Yeah, guys, I hope you all take this and expand upon it and make your own really cool creations and minigames. Bye!